good Sunday morning everybody. Ooh. I've just been having a snooze on the couch. I was listening to a podcast which I was playing a game um, and I woke up, I'm on my own. Oh. Oh, ghosties. Something fell over. Ghosties. Oh. What was it? Your light. My lights just fell off the tower. I'll get some command strips and we'll really catch it, yeah. Yeah. Oh well, anyway. Morning. I'm not on my own anymore. I just woke up and wonder where everybody was. Oh, you're about to be. It's podcast time. Moving on. very blue on the screen okay guys that's michelle she's just finished a podcast the podcast will be going up wednesday i believe uh a week on wednesday a week on wednesday all about books so may my hand up if you want to listen to it or not now i'm going to go and do my editing and uh we're going to settle down and watch some films this afternoon i think mm -hmm. don't have anything else to do finish the washing um uh, Michelle's closing on the dryer, so there's just that to do, and that's it. And Michelle's back at work next week, so we'll get an early start in the morning. I'll put my alarm clock quarter an hour forward, I think. Back? No, I'll put it forward. So get up earlier. You get up earlier when you put your clock forward. No. You do. No. Spring forward, you get up an hour earlier, put it back, you get an extra hour in bed. No, if you're going to put your clock forward, you're going to be moving it from, say, 6 o'clock to 6.15. Yeah. So you're going to be getting up 15 minutes later, not earlier. It's all right. 6.15? Luxury! You have to get up, you start getting up now at 6 o'clock, my love. I'll have to start getting up at 5.45. Yep. Anyway, I'll go and get me anything done. Okay guys, it's Sunday evening now. Uh, just had my tea, which was a big steak pie, and I've overfaced myself, I couldn't finish it. How about you, are you overfaced? A little. Yeah, I think, I think, I think we had too much, did too much. Uh, yeah. 25 past 5 and because I was listening to a podcast this morning about the Battersea Poltergeist BBC Sounds we decided to watch The Conjuring so that's what we're going to watch now unless they've got that Enfield Haunting oh yeah I could have a look for that one because mm, you watched The Conjuring not that long ago yeah I'll, I'll, I'll have a look can you remember what the programme's called? I'll look into it. The Enfield haunting, I think. <laughs> Is that because it happened in Enfield? Okay, guys, so we found the Enfield haunting. So we're going to watch that because it's very similar to the Battersea Pol uh, Poltergeist, which actually predates this uh, chronologically. Uh, that word. Chronologically. Chronologically. So this took place in 1950. Late 1956, 57 to 60 something. And anyway, this took place in the 1970s, the Enfield Haunting, didn't it? I think I was a. I don't know. I can't remember. I may remember it or I may remember something about it anyway. Probably read it in the papers or whatever. Anyway, moving on. Mm -hmm. 